Yeah, welcome to my show today. And uh, um, it's a bit, a little bit late, uh, but notwithstanding, <clears throat> I've got a full package. I just want you to watch this video uh, before I make any comment on this. Uh, bear with me. Um, it's um, a normal uh, video. Bear with me. Yeah, good evening, Paul. Uh, if you're just tuning in, just bear with me. Um, I'm going to release the videos now. Um, don't worry. It's just one of those days. Hi, good evening, uh, Femi. Um, how are you? Um, top, thank you. Um, how are you, uh, Femi? How are you? Right. Um, bear with me. Um, um, how are you guys? Welcome to today's show. Um, have uh, left a little bit too late, uh, but it's not. I'm going to send the video before I make any comments today. You remember in the series, we started from series one, when we excavated, they dug the, the, the foundation. And uh, when the, uh, the foundation was dug, they we laid the foundation, we laid the uh, bricks, we laid the, um, what's it called? The granite and everything. And uh, this is another stage that we are now. Um, just want to quickly, let um, a couple of fans um, know that I'm online now. Oh, uh, it's Femi. Right. Okay. When we started, we, like I said, we started this project with a lovely um, fans uh, from, uh, from one of my fans on YouTube. About seven months ago, he did not, he did not have this finance to do this uh, but while he was watching the video he learned a lot from this and he was able to put this project together so i welcome all of you uh how many days does it take to lay all the woods and bamboos for the decking the wood and bamboo the bamboo the wood is a week not more than a week thank you uh femi Thank you for coming to this today's show. Um, uh, how are you, uh, Femi 08404? Welcome to all of you uh, that we are here together. We are all here together to lift one another up 
um, especially because we are not in Nigeria or in Africa or any place where we are we want to do our project. A lot of things have been happening and they have been swindling and been giving people incorrect information as to their projects that they are doing. They are exploiting them. They are overpricing materials. They are overestimating materials that is needed for their project. And because of this, people are frustrated. So on this forum, we want to prevent this. We want to minimize this. We want to reduce the risk. And that is why we have started this. This is series six of the series of a five unit of one bedroom flat, uh, five, um, five units of one bedroom flat and two units of two bedroom flat. And if you look at this, this is a very good contractor. He's doing a good job and I've commended him um, I've scrutinized some of the things it's done. Oh, thank you, Femi. Thank you. Right. So we're moving. I'm going to stop now and I will show you the stage. Uh, stage one, two, three, four, five. Stage one excavation, uh, digging the foundation and uh, doing, laying the foundation, putting the concrete on the floor, the blinding. And then we did the German floor. If you have just come into this uh, forum, Go and watch series one, watch series two, four, watch series three, four, and five. And you will be able to follow all the progress on this young man's project that is one of our fans on this forum. So one minute, let me just take you around to series six, the videos, the, the foundation, uh, no, not the foundation, the, 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 the columns and the pillars and the, and the, the, the two inch by 12 i'm going to explain the materials that was used at this point in time for this decking um it's not a, it's not a long video but i'm going to you are going to learn from it and then i will make comments at the end of the day just bear with me welcome to all of you on this show all right right this is the um the uh, you remember a uh, series five the uh inch by 12 the wood, the decking, the decking wood and the bamboo was not there. Okay, I'll take you to next picture. Right, look at that. Last Sunday, this was not there. Okay. Right, bear with me. Yeah, so the, the young man don't want to be out of pocket, out of water. There are three storage tanks that they have pro uh, provided for the supply of water regularly on the site. Some people, they do, uh, do uh, what's it called, um, dig a borehole, all right? We're coming to that. Look at that. If you are familiar with the first uh, one, two, three, four, five series, you will understand what I'm talking about. Right, look at the top of the decking before they put... Uh, look at the beam. The beam is the area that would join and hold the decking together. That is the one that is not covered by the inch by 12. When your contractor is talking about inch by 12, each length of this wood is called inch by 12. Okay? So that area that is left that you are looking at the blocks is where the beam we sit on the iron rod that is used for the beam is thicker and bigger uh, than the ones that they're going to stretch all through you are going to see the video in a minute if you're just tuning in just um, come along with me all right uh, hello, uh, uh, Anieka. hello everyone thank you my brother thank you you're welcome to this show wherever country you are come you are from don't be afraid to start a project in Nigeria or in Africa or in West Africa or anywhere. Do not be afraid. Just come with me. Look at that picture there. That is the um, the wood that they use is inch by twelve, uh, inch by twelve of the fan, of of the decking. So and all the ones that are pointing up are sixteen mm for the iron rod. Of course, when they want to do the beam. The beam is, they use a thicker iron rod for the beam. So don't, 
um, do not let your contractor um, fob you off with that. All right? Let's check some videos. right yeah thank you very much lovely guys um if i can take you through the a uh, few things which were you know, the videos which you have just watched um a few minutes ago um yeah i did that call only how are you welcome 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 to the show today now let me First and foremost, um, 
to a point of um, um, uh, an analysis of what you've just seen. Uh, looking at the video, we started series one, series two, series three, series four. Obviously, for those that have been following the series, you will know that this project is going stage by stage every week. And this is an encouragement to all of us who are planning to start a project anywhere in Nigeria or Africa. It is not a rocket science. It is not a rocket science and it is not something that you have to pay over the odds. It is a simple, simple steps and st basic steps. Foundation dog and gradually the, 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 the German floor done and then 10 coaches was done on top of German floors and then the lintel and after the lintel two coaches or three coaches is put on top of the lintel concrete right some people do two coaches is a standard one while some people do three coaches if they want high ceiling inside their house and in this case this young man have done well he's done three coaches on top of the on top of the of the lintel and after the lint after that is done then they start the decking and um, if you see the image if you look at the image of the thumbnail the thumbnail picture that you see um at the front of this channel is the way and manner that house is going to look like in the end so there's nothing that and it's one of our own that are always watching this program and apparently it's one of us but i am not going to disclose who the person or the location of the property for security purposes and for data protection reason right we are our brother's keeper what god has done for him is that it's no good to be blowing his or or, or somebody's front trumpet but it is something like a lesson for all of us to emulate he's done very well he's one of those that listen that can hear that can that will take instructions he got so much instruction for me and i'm so happy i'm glad for this young man he's done very well the project is done there is not even up to, up to up to a plot it's not up to a plot so right now at the stage where they are the iron rod they have used to uh for the for the span of the decking um let me let me just um interject here The iron rod, look at the steps. They run the iron rod correctly. And this is not finished because I'm still coming to bring the video of the conduit pipe. Because the conduit pipe, before the decking is done, the, this conduit pipe is the one that the wirings, the electrical wirings will go through. If some of you have never watched any of my video before, you can watch some of other videos which I've done on YouTube. There's conduit piping. After this stage is the pipe that will be got, that will be embedded under the iron rod, which all the electrical cables will pass through, all the distribution box cable will pass through, all the um, gas paper cable, the satellite cable will pass through. This young man has not done it. What they are trying to do this week was to get this decking situation, decking, uh, um, uh, uh, decking level, the wood, so to stand the weight of the concrete. That is what they have decided to do. So if uh, um, you, you, are, you, are, you can always follow this, I'm not too, I, I might be able to bring another video weekend um, so that uh, we can uh, uh, learn more. Uh, depends on what images or videos I get, I, I receive from the owner, uh, I might be able to uh, bring uh, something. For those of us who are at this stage, who are about to get to, to this level, who are about to, uh, to uh, or you have not bought a land, this is an encouragement. We need encouragement. This day and age, we need somebody who has been there and back. We need somebody who has already put his own investment on this. Uh, we need people who have done all these things. And that is why we're bringing all these things. Uh, 
the, the contractors are shelling all wrong information over pricing materials, trying to uh, increase the total number of materials and be able to put money into their pocket. That is what we are trying to avoid here. We are hustlers. We work hard for money wherever place we are based in the world, whether in Asia, whether in America, whether in Europe, whether in Japan, name it, we are hardworking people and we must not allow these, these hoodlums to run away with our money. So today, I want you to understand that this forum is basically for, for people who, want, who have dreams and who wants their dreams to be actualized. It, it is possible. If this young man seven months ago who owns this project did not did not did not have a penny did not uh, he's been hearing news that that people 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 are are, are people are, are stealing people's money uh people take uh advantage of people but he took the bull by the horn he said oh, don't worry i am going to go to nigeria and he, he, what he did he's been guided he listened to advice he got instruction, he sent us his quotations, we scrutinize it, we guide him, and look at the project of not even up to a two block. Look at what you if you haven't done anything, you can see you can do it. You can do it. You can you don't allow this this uh, 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 contractors to, to bully you. Some contractors are so they went to the extent to the extent where they, they they themselves before they even finish your, before you even finish your own project they have finished their project but because of people like that we set up this forum we helping people we guide people like i said please don't expect me to give you a free analysis um after you watch this easy video it's free but uh, when you want to get anything from me, you, uh, you have to pay. Right. When people have been encouraging us, I'm not going to mention people's name. There's a young man also. He started his own project. I've got, he sent me his quotation. I'm scrutinizing it. I'm making sure that he's going to be well guided when, when he wants to decide to finish. The bamboo is there. The bamboo, uh, um, if I look at the number of bamboo that was used for this, yeah, um, for this project, I'm looking at the total number of bamboo that was used on this. So to give you an idea, bear, bear with me. Bear with me. I'm trying to see if I can see the total number of bamboo that was used. Um, you can have an idea. Bear with me. Oh, gosh. I'm going to have a right i can't i can't find the analysis the breakdown but i am pretty sure i have it somewhere um at my spare time i will get the breakdown total number of bamboos that was used for that project there so you could say aha when they are doing your uh your decking the ring in between the the columns do not let allow them to do not allow them to do gap too much gap because it's not going to hold the concrete for long for years it's not going to hold the concrete if there's too much gap in between uh the the, the iron rod uh the length of the iron rod in between the span of one length to the other oh hello lori um Oh, you're welcome, Olori. So uh, you came here a little bit late. We we started um, um, about 27 minutes ago. Maybe you can go back and watch this. That is this. Um, um, that's the, the step there. 
That's a step to the upper floor. They haven't put um, uh, iron rods there, but you will see, see it in the end of the last image, which I'm going to show again. Uh, uh, that, that, if you look at the steps now, they're not putting iron, iron rods across. That's a very, look at the width of that, that step. Uh, the width of that step indicates that when they are bringing fridge freezers and everything, they can they will be able to pass through properly. Okay, I've got three minutes. I'm not. I have not rested uh, for the past couple of days. I've been doing analysis of people's quotations. So, right, this is a big lesson to all of us. Kazim, um, weather a bit cool today. Yeah, I know. I know, Kazim. Well done. Now your project, Kazim. Well done. Um, this one of these days, I'm going to bring your own project also online. You are doing very well, fantastically in your project. I know you showed me, sent something to me on Messenger uh, yesterday. You are doing very well as a young man who is based uh, who is based abroad. I'm not going to mention the location. I know Kazim is in Canada. I've sent, mentioned it several times here. Kazim, thank you for listening to us and and um, trying to 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 uh, to show that. There is also opportunity that we can take advantage of. Not, not necessarily you have to, not every, not necessarily Lagos. Kazim is doing his project uh, in somewhere in Nigeria, but not Lagos. Um, the, it's a big, fantastic project. I've seen the pictures, and the contractors are doing very well. Kazim also have learned uh, on this show. He has been following me ever since I started this program. Uh, he's a young man who. Who wants to learn? Who who's, who who is taking instruction well? And when you take good instruction, you are not likely to make mistake. Well done, Kazim. Well done. The God who started the work, the project that you show you sent to me on um, uh, Facebook Messenger, uh, we complete it, and you will get get the resources. You will live long. You have a long life to be able to complete it, and you have enough money to complete the project because. One thing is that sometimes when there is no enough money, you leave a project for a very long time. And then what happens? Your the appetite and curiosity start going down. So this young man has decided to take the bull by the horn. Um, um I can see well done. Thank you. Um I, I didn't mention the location. Uh well done, well done, Kazi. Well done. I know you started it and you're bearing, you're getting instruction from me, and I appreciate you that you don't. Um, uh, underestimate us, and you don't, um, um, uh, um, you don't, uh, you're not, you're not proud. Uh, you're, you're, you are, you're somebody who, who wants to learn. Uh, Ray, can you let us know the quantities and size of iron rod? The iron rod used, Femi, is 16 mm. Ah, uh, 16 mm iron rod is what they have used here. So trust me, do not. I mean, I mean, I know you've given your quotation. I'm still scrutinizing it, but I'm going to guide you, as I promised. I'm going to to uh, guide you all the way. Let me be honest with you. Femi too has started his project. Is um, I sent his quotation that some of the contractors have sent, and I won't I won't lie. Femi gave me some money. I'm not going to mention how much he paid me. He's paid uh, for the service, and I'm ready. To support him all through throughout the construction of the project. So, Femi, thank you for that. I said, I just said I should acknowledge that in the presence of everybody. I'm not making any story up here. Femi, thank you. Um, how many tons? I mean, this ton, your own property, Femi, is bigger than this. So they have used, bear with me. Let me see if I can get the analysis. I'll tell you the number of the tons they are using for this project. Bear with me. Um, I'm, I'm coming. I think I've got the tons of the iron. Yeah. Bear with me, Femi. Sorry, bear with me. Um, I'm going to look at the, the analysis of the, the, the your iron rod.
Yes, we use loads of um, um, on this project 130 lengths of 12 mm. That's why I was telling you, Femi, they have put too much quotation on your iron rod, but I don't want to, to speak too soon. Okay, I'm scrutinizing it. Uh, this is a five unit of um, five units of one bedroom flat downstairs and two units of two bedroom um, en suite. Okay, 16 mm rod um, used is 130 length. That is about two tons. Two tons of 16 mm rod. Okay, and 12 mm, 640. Um, hold on, 640. No, that shouldn't be. Um, length 220, 220 length of uh, 8 mm, 640 length. No, no, that's this is not right. 32 trips of um, 32 trips of sand. No, that's not right. Um, granite of different sizes, 1250 bags now. 250 bags of cement and five bundles of binding wire. Uh, the planks, um, the decking level, we use 680, uh, 600, uh, 680 length of planks of an uh, inch by 12, 600, uh, sorry, uh, 680 of them length because it's another big property okay and uh, um three six bags of three inches nail and three bags of three inches nail that was used on this on this um wooden for the decking okay so um please let's take cognizance of the kind of people that keeps coming back asking for more money. We try to prevent people from not paying over the odds of the materials that is needed. I've got three minutes more, guys, um, to round up the today's broadcast. I'm a bit exhausted. So please bring your question in three minutes. Uh, we will, all of you, Olori, I want to be hearing about your project. I want to be hearing your project. Kazim, I know that your project is ongoing. Femi, your project is ongoing. This is a forum where we share, we are progressive forum. This is a forum where people discuss about great things, great development, future achievements, current achievements, correct uh, past that they have done that they want to. Uh, 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 Take uh, to take uh, for, take money of them, learn, take money. I mean, uh, uh, exploit them. We want to prevent exploitation. We want to uh, uh, make people to be happy. We don't want people to be frustrated. People are not to be trusted, especially family members. You don't entrust them with things. Um, so here we give you idea. We encourage people, even if you've gone through that route, and. Um, and you you've come back and it's not right doesn't mean that that's the end you can still try it again and you can you can succeed this time around we are here to encourage ourselves we have done so much to leave our country and we are based in the country where we are we're doing doing good things and we are during the difficult weather and during the good weather we know that it's not easy after pay, paying our bills servicing our cars getting food into the house looking after the family now to now leave get some money apart and do something unless you borrow money good big money from the bank it is not possible it is not easy unless people learn that money it is not easy to do some of the projects that our guys and you and i wants to embark on and then still not monitor it right it's either we sell something sell a car sell a house get credit from the bank which they will always ought to ask for the money you pay huge interest rate on this money so because of that we cannot afford to mess around with whatever outlay that we are doing with the money so this is going to be a high opener this young man uh 
have done very well several months ago. He has not been able to do this, but look at the fantastic project he's doing. You and I can do. What I want to be hearing for those of us who have not started something, it's not too late. We are just in September by tomorrow. We pick September now. September starts. We can still do it. It's not how long, but how well. And when, when, when you start, you are well equipped with information here and there to start and complete it properly. God is a completer. God is a finisher. We will finish. We will do very well. We end up where we are not going to rot in the countries where we are. We have come to improve our life. We have come to get things better, to get across. We are not going to go, go to go, go to have a bad bad time. We will have good time. We will go and uh, what the Bible says, we will build a house, we we'll live in it. So that is how it should be. So my friends, you are lovely and wonderful people that I, I, I work together on this forum. Keep coming. By this time, by October, by November, by December, I want to be hearing that I have done the roof. I want to be hearing that we have done the windows. We have done the aluminum. We have done the, 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 the uh, general roof. We have done the plastering. We have done the plumbing. We have done the bowl. We have done the, 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 the ceiling. We have done the painting by Christmas. I want to be hearing, oh, God, sir, can you get tell me where I can get my tenant? I want to be hearing that by December, my tenant, my first tenant, I'm, get, I'm collecting the money from my first tenant. Now, do you want to be a tenant or you want to be a landlord? From time immemorial, there's always a tenant, there's always a landlord. You, can't have, you couldn't have spent so much years abroad and now begin to go and go and be renting out or living with neighbors or living with friends or living with uncle that you don't you are not secured that you have to be paying and being the one to finance their 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 their, uh, their uh, uh, finance them in the house the food and everything so it's not right you choose what you want to be you want to be a landlord to rent a house out uh, uh, the landlord if you build a house if you buy a house if you build a house, it, it means that you have invested your money, you secure your future, you secure your pension, you don't have to be looking for where to live when you go to Nigeria. Or, and if it doesn't go on well, you can decide and sell the house, the money will come back to you. So, guys, just a few seconds to go. Merci beaucoup. You are wonderful and amazing set of people which will always do things better together, right? Until, un, until I come on your way again on. Uh, Wednesday or midweek or Sunday, this is your one and only Damola. Um, Femi, Kazim, Adedakpo, um, Olori. All of you that have been part of today's show, fantastic. Hope you have a wonderful week. Femi, 08404. Wherever country where you are, please, economy does not stay as it is. It will always get better. It will always get worse. It can always be better when you know what you are doing by taking the resources of that country and take it back to the country where you came from and invest something. That is when you we can classify that you succeed because the people you left at home, they are building mansions. They are building houses. So, but it's going to be a failure. If you spend three years, five years, six years, you decide to leave Nigeria, Africa, West Africa, Kenya, Uganda, anywhere you came from from Africa, I spent a couple of years and there's no change, no physical, material change to your life back home. It is going to be classified as a failure. But it's not too late. If you haven't done anything, it's not too late. You can buy half plot. You can buy full plot. You can buy full plot and share with a friend. They, if you see what they are building on half plot, of these days, you'll be amazed. That land that you're seeing there is not full plot, even though it's longer than a plot, it's not a full plot, it's more or less like a three quarter of a plot. So, it is possible that you can build fantastic mansion on a half plot. On this note, I leave you with these positive vibes. You are amazing, wonderful, intelligent, hardworking, resilient, uh, pushful, fantastic Nigerians and Africans that are based abroad that will improve their life eventually. Thank you. Merci beaucoup. Good, good, have a good week, all of you.
go have a good week. Go have a fantastic week. Go have a good week. Right. Okay. I'm going to close now. So, um, sorry, it's uh, it's not going to be a long one hour. I need to rest. I've been on the go this week. Uh, so, thank you for all of you that have um, supported me financially. When you ask for one thing or the other to be done for you, I appreciate you, and I will not let you down. I will do a very very incredible job for you. I will follow you all through. I please. When you are texting me, don't text me. I'm not going to give you an answer. I said it in my last video because there has been pressure here and there. People asking me questions. Sometimes on, on when I'm going to bed midnight, they call me and I give them free information. Please, the video on the YouTube is for information and it's free only. But anything outside YouTube, um, Femi, thank you for your um, support financially. I'm going to charge people for money. All right. Thank you. I'm going to stop here now. Merci beaucoup. Au revoir. Thank you. Bye-bye. And bye-bye. God bless you. Have a wonderful, great week, wherever location you are, in Singapore, in Malaysia, in Japan, in uh, US, Canada, UK, Europe, name it. You are wonderful people. Thank you. And bye-bye. Thank you.